In 2019, the Langham Group entrusted the Matteo Tune Studio with a commission for a new five-star hotel in Venice. The project site is in Murano, in an abandoned area previously occupied by a glass factory. The entire design has been guided by the principle of contemporary expression coexisting with historical expression. The historic buildings, including, for example, the Casino Mochinigo, a building that dates back to the 16th century and houses frescoes from the Veronese school, directly overlooks the lagoon and will be the main point of arrival for guests arriving by sea. The new buildings are all clad and characterized by a contemporary facade made of horizontal glass slats, which are obviously a tribute to the site's functional heritage and to the island of Murano, and are supported by vertical metal elements. The facade was analyzed and parametrically modeled in order to best define the optimal positioning of the slats to improve their shading and visual protection. The historic buildings being restored were bolstered with a system of false walls that were entirely modeled in the software right from the start, which allowed us to immediately understand the spatiality of the interior. The use of Archicad from the concept phase to the schematic design phase allowed us to quickly obtain a clear vision of the external spaces of the architecture, but also, above all, the internal spaces. In particular, Archicad has tornato extremely utile sia con i propri In particular, Archicad has proved to be extremely useful with its native tools, like the curtain wall and railing tools, with which we were able to model and structure all those internal partitions and finishes, such as the wall panels and internal surface coverings. And then using the library part maker tool. With the library part maker, we were able to build an ad hoc object library with different levels of object detailing, depending on the needs of our consultants. This allowed for an optimized data exchange, providing the consultants with the tailored information necessary for their respective professional fields. Because the project required the application of the BIM methodology, many stakeholders became involved, such as the engineering firm which dealt with the structures, and the engineering firm that dealt with the MEP systems, and the company which surveyed and built up the existing model, the so-called HBIM, Heritage BIM, and also the company which carried out the coordination of the disciplinary models. Within the BIM project management process, the various disciplinary models were uploaded to the common data environment during periodic meetings, where all the models precisely developed by the different stakeholders were federated or assembled into a single model, from which the BIM coordination processes were carried out, like code checking, model checking, clash detection and so on. Coordinamento BIM, quindi di code checking, model checking, clash detection, etc. e inoltre veniva utilizzato anche per uscire diciamo And the BIM project was also used to expand the model beyond the three standard dimensions we are used to by adding the new BIM dimensions like the fourth dimension that is timing the time schedules and cost management. For the studio, it was a first opportunity to structure a BIM library and develop a 100% BIM project. 